Hello, Power Rangers fans, and welcome back to Rangers of the Universe. I'm Chris, and in this video, I will be talking about some more Power Rangers once and always reunion special news. Now, we have only two days left until the premiere at 3 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, which is where I live on the East Coast, for the once and always special launching on Netflix. Now, if you haven't checked out that trailer, or watch my video breakdown of the trailer with some theories, be sure to go and check that out immediately and give that a good watch through because that trailer was absolutely fantastic. And that was like a 1 minute 27 second trailer of a 55 minute special. So you just know this is going to be a fantastic special. And already, you know, we've gotten since the trailer a couple new... uh behind the scenes photos that I wanted to talk about about very amazing part of it a big part of the special that I'm definitely really liking that they did with the plot I think it was an excellent aspect to bring this all together and form it and what am I talking about captured rangers so for a while now in behind the scenes photos we've gotten and that first behind the scenes video that dropped on January 17th we saw this uh what we now know is a time machine device made by Robo Rita or made by whoever I'm guessing her that is powered by these lightning collection figures which are our captured rangers. Now in my video breakdown of it from what we saw with that, obviously it's already confirmed we saw since then. Mighty Morphin, red, pink, and green. Now, red and pink, we obviously see Rocky and Cat. So this red and pink, you know, we see, sadly, the Yellow Ranger, Trini Kwan, die at the hands of Rita Rep Robo Rita Repulsa. And there's the capture of Jason, Tommy, and Kim. Those are those three, which also helps explain why their actors aren't in the special. Amy Jo Johnson. Austin St. John definitely couldn't do to legal reasons. And Jason David Frank, this was recorded before his passing. Him and Amy turned it down because, you know, I mean, there's a lot of reasons. It's nobody's business why they did. Amy's got a great project ahead. Super excited for her work on Boom Studio Comics that she will be doing. And I will be sure to check that out. Now, Captured Rangers, as I started talking about. We also saw on this big screen when Alpha said, Rangers, go to your assigned stations now. You saw a big board that said on the uh, command center console, Bandora Protocol, which for those that don't know, Easter egg right there, Bandora is the Super Sentai form of our Rita Repulsa from Drew Ranger. So, Bandora Protocol, it's a pretty cool Easter egg that they threw in there. I really do like that. So we got that. And you would see on it names of various ranger places that we've had. You see Coral Harbor, Reefside, Astro Megaship, Turtle Cove, and Terra Venture. Now, for captured rangers, before we had Beast Morphers Red and Gold that we could see clearly, Dino Thunder Red and White, In Space Black, and Lost Galaxy Red, Blue, and Green. Three of my favorites. Hate to see that they've been captured. But since then, we've also got a clearer look at the other side. So we can also add that Beast Morphers Blue has been captured in space yellow, Wild Force Silver, and you see the Phantom Ranger. So Phantom Ranger is also on that list. Now, there's another yellow ranger next to the Phantom that we see from the photo posted by Simon Bennett. Now, that one was not seen clearly in a behind-the-scenes photo posted by David Yost where that was the only one that was missing by this point. So that is the 16th Captured Ranger. A hard to take, get a look at Yellow Ranger. Now, they're using Lightning Collection figures. Our options for Yellow Ranger are, obviously it's not going to be Mighty Morphin Yellow. So that leaves Zeo Yellow, SPD Yellow, Lost Galaxy Yellow, and Donald Under Yellow. So that leaves four Yellow Rangers. Now, I mean, SPD Yellow... B-Squad 1 hasn't happened yet, 2025. That's when, and we're not at 2025 timeline. This is 2023. So 
SPD Yellow is out of the running. Now, I've seen people comment, it can't be Lost Galaxy Yellow or SPD Yellow anyway. This was filmed before we before those two figures were announced. Figures are in the design process for a year. They had these, I don't doubt they had those two Lightning Collection figures made by this time. But no, I it's definitely not either of them. I mean, SPD Yellow, it's not going to be Z. There's no way possible that it is unless, well, time travel does play a role. but her is extremely unlikely, plus it does not look like Z. And it doesn't look like Maya. Lost Galaxy Yellow, that's definitely not Lost Galaxy. I mean, it doesn't have, you would clearly see the black zigzags on the wrists and boots. It's not there, it's not Maya. It is Tanya, Zio Yellow. Now, this also makes sense because on those lists of Cities where rangers have gone missing locations. Angel Grove's not on there. The special is taking place in Angel Grove, and we see the juice bar there. So Phantom and Zeo Yellow, I'm going with that they're part of Angel Grove. Phantom might have come back there at some point, and he got captured. I don't know. But those are the 16 captured rangers we are seeing. Now, I've seen people comment anywhere, oh, are we going to see other rangers in the special? No, I don't believe so. I don't think we're going to have like Danny Slavin or like um, Reggie Roll, Archie Cow, you know, Roger who played um, in Space Black, Tracy who played in Space Yellow. I don't expect, I mean, I don't expect any of these actor, actors to return. I definitely don't think so. If anything, you know, this is heavily Mighty Morphin focused. I definitely think we're going to get a look at Mighty Morphin Red, Pink, and Green being captured. They'll be our first casualties of being captured Rangers. But I don't expect us to see any of these other Rangers captured. I think it's going to be off screen, which then is when it flashes to read us. I mean, um, Alpha saying, Rangers, go to your assigned stations now because there have been reports from Rangers going missing in these locations. So I don't expect to see any of these Ranger suits now. If we do, I think it'd be maybe like one of the locations they choose and be suit actors. It's not going to be the returning Rangers. I don't expect any of them out, any of the others to cameo. You know, if anything, maybe we just might see suit actors and see one of these teams captured. But that's the best I think we're going to get. So that's where we're at with it. We know the 16 Rangers that have been captured now. Obviously, we'll see them freed by the end of the special which is at that point you could either see maybe they teleport back to their places or maybe you just see the suit actors of all 16 in the suits and that's it. Who knows? You know, we got to wait a couple more days to see. But I just wanted to talk about these 16 captured Rangers. And, I mean, I think it's some cool picks that they did because obviously we have a lot of Lightning Collection figures to work with. There's a lot they could have went with with it. But I think they did some good picks with it. I mean, obviously, you know, Lost Galaxy has got a special place in my heart. So seeing those three figures there, it's like, damn, they were captured. But, I mean, I can't wait to see. You know, we got Robo Rita, Robo Minotaur, Robo Snizzard. Min's taking up the yellow powers. You know, she's going to be training with Billy and Zack and all of them. This is definitely going to be a fantastic special that I can't wait to see. And, I mean... It's awesome that they're even doing the 30th anniversary. That time traveling device, oh my god. That prop maker did a fantastic job. It looks phenomenal. And I love that they're especially using the Lightning Collection figures that Hasbro designed themselves. You know, it's awesome to see those in the special too. And I mean, I absolutely can't wait for the special. I definitely think, you know, we're going to find out where uh, Zach's been the last... 29 years since we saw him leave for the Peace Conference. I definitely expect us to hear about Aquatar with Billy. I think that is going to be heard about. You know, the special is also supposed to be like, obviously it's very Trini heavy. You know, we have Trini's death. It's in memoriam to Dai Trang and Jason David Frank because they did a lot of voice work after that. So, you know, and the actors have said like it's going to do an in memoriam to him as well. So I definitely expect this to be amazing and us to have some like backstory of where they've been. 
I could definitely see Cat name dropping and maybe saying J.J. Oliver and something like that. But overall, I can't wait for it. You know, two more days. Definitely tune in. Check it out. I know I will be. I'm going to do a video review of it. So be sure to check out that review. Now, let me know in the comments below what you think of the Captured Ranger aspect of it. I mean, that's definitely Zeo Yellow there. Do you think it's not? Let me know. But Zeo Yellow highly makes sense too because, I mean, she's a Zeo Ranger. We've got, for Zeo Rangers, Adam, Rocky, and Cat. Now, Adam won't be morphing. He's doing SPA work. But she definitely makes sense. I mean, best friends with Na Tanya and Cat were best friends, just like Nakia and Catherine in real life. So, I definitely highly think it's Zeo Yellow. I mean, the only other option would be Donald Under Yellow, and that does not look like Donald Under Yellow at all. So, it's definitely Zeo Yellow. So, that's our lineup for the 16 Captured Rangers. Now, this has been a short video, but just wanted to talk about these real quick because I love the idea of it, and I'm excited for this special. So, that's all for this video. Hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and ring that bell for notifications. Now, also, be sure to check the description below to follow us on Instagram and Twitter. Instagram especially, I've been very active, posting about once, or once and always, promoting it, because I'm just super excited, and you know, this is something that the fandom should be excited for and back up. Because who knows, this could lead to maybe more reunion specials down the road. And that would be fantastic for the franchise. We're in our 30th year and just keep going from here. So follow us on, especially on Instagram, Rangers underscore of the underscore universe. Now, as I said, that's all for this video. But be sure to tune in for more Super Sentai Kamen Rider and Power Rangers content. Also, have the live stream with Emily Bader. I think it's uh, Jarrett joining her and John Warden. Jordan Liv was busy, but he'll be doing a little uh, special guest in it. Who knows what it'll be about. Got to tune in to find out at 11 a.m. So be sure to tune in, check it out. I'll be doing a video review of that live stream as well for some awesome toy reveals that we have coming. So, see you soon.